Wait, Say no. hey to Cece's YouTube channel. Say hey, my name is Apollo. I'm Natasha Nicole's little brother. And Carter's such a great nephew. Thank you. <laughs> hey. I'm looking for chapstick. Oh, I know where it's at. But, um, yeah, so the vlog, this vlog is starting late because today is Tuesday, October something. 11th? 12th? I don't know. One of those two. But, um, yeah, I'm just babysitting my little, babysitting my little brother today. I have nothing special going on. I don't have any, um, clients today either, so... It's gonna be a chill day. What, baby? Come here. He was laughing. Hold on. So yeah, it's just gonna be a chill day. Um, I pulled out a old wig out of my wig closet that I plan on trying to revamp today. So that would be like a separate video on its own. So other than that, yeah, that's that's it for today. And find something to cook, which I have no idea what that would be i will see y'all whenever we get to the orthodontist now that i have this baby with me i can't hold my camera on this baby and his stuff so i'll see y'all in just a few but i just want to come through and say what's up we are doing the vlog this week even though there's not much happening but we're still going to vlog probably a bad angle for me so we're still going to vlog and um get it started this week i do know sunday um we're headed to atlanta to take the kids to this like pumpkin thing at stone mountain or whatever so we will be doing that that'll be exciting um i have appointments tomorrow to friday i don't think i have any plans saturday somebody said something i was supposed to be maybe going out saturday like a cousin's kind of thing not sure um may end up doing that but not sure and then sunday so we have a little bit going on this week just not a whole lot so this vlog may be shorter because i felt like last week if you watched that vlog there wasn't a lot going on but okay i was wondering when you was finally gonna cry i was wondering do you even know how to cry come on, come on. are you hungry no, we can't, we can't even go what was wrong. I, I would just, why didn't he put the toys back? I just do that happen, so. Do you stinky? No, let's go wash this face. All right, guys, so, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and, um, we're just going to go ahead and head to the orthodontist and, yeah. I think he's being grouchy this morning. Maybe he's hungry. I ain't had a baby in so long. Are you hungry? You hungry? I've been trying to give you a bye bye and you didn't want it. You don't know what he want to do. But anyway, we will see y'all in a few. Deuces. Tell them deuces, Apollo. Tell them deuces. Now you laughing. Tell them deuces. Okay. All right, y'all. So I am back at the house. You're probably wondering why I'm whispering because my little brother's in his sleep. He fell asleep in a car. Carter got his retractor. It's like a metal thing that's on the roof of his mouth freaked out at the orthodontist just like last week he flipped out he's like i can't swallow i can't swallow she's like baby it feels weird in your mouth but you'll get used to it i have to show y'all i'll show y'all what it looks like in his mouth but anyway so now he's okay he's in there watching tv apollo's in there sleep um since we're back at the house <sighs> let me tell you so while i was at the orthodontist <sighs> This little girl hits my car. Bruh. Bruh. Like, I was like, it's something about people just, like, running into me. Like, how did you not see my car? I was literally, I was waiting for a park because there was, like, no parking space in this area, in this parking lot, right? So I pulled up, and I'm just waiting. I see a guy walking out, and I'm like, bet. And when he pulls out, I'm just going to back into his parking spot. Well, I'm sitting there, and I'm looking back, and I'm just waiting, you know, for him I see the car that is like right there at Carter's back driver's side door. I see her lights go into reverse. I was like, no, no, no. Hurry up, put my car in drive. Moved up just enough that she actually hit the bumper versus hitting the door where my son was sitting. So 
that would have been really bad. And I got Apollo too, but it would have, Carter was on that side behind me. So he's on the passenger driver's side. So I end up hurrying up and moving into drive fast enough to the point that she only hit the back of the car. Granted, it is just like scuffed up or whatever. And she's a younger girl because at the orthodontist, you know, kids are just now getting cars and stuff like this. So I just, I, I just, she just started crying. I was like, baby, you got to start like looking behind you and making sure nobody is there. Like if she clearly would have looked in her rearview mirror, she clearly would have seen my car. A whole fucking car. Like completely, like I had her in the parking spot but i didn't even know nobody was even in the car so she just never even looked back you how do you back up and not look behind you how do you not turn around and she was in an older honda civic but it's like i know that car doesn't have a backup camera on it but it's like that's even more reason like they didn't teach you to literally turn around i don't care if i have a backup camera i still turn around and i still use my mirrors like but that just comes with time. I backed into people. So her dad actually uh, worked on campus. So he was only like down the street. Um, and he came and I just told him that, you know, it wasn't really dented in. It was more so to the point where I feel like I could kind of like buff it out or have it detailed out. So he's just going to pay to like detail the car. He was like, you know, if we end up having to replace the whole bumper, then we'll turn around with file on my insurance. So I just got, we just traded information and whatnot and just kind of let it go, which I think I'm gonna kind of let it go. It's just like, I feel like they'd be able to wax it out enough to where I'm okay with it. It's not a big deal. I don't have like a newer car, so I'm not like too upset about it, you know. Carter is in there on his video game. I can hear him explaining to the people like, I'm sorry, I got my extender in, so it's a little bit hard for me to talk. Don't, so don't understand me. Well, don't understand me. I was just saying it. I was just saying it because it's kind of hard for me to talk with it. You okay, bud? Mm -hmm. Open up. Let me let me show people what your what's in your mouth. He has an extender. Like, can you see back there? Probably not, but it's back there. So. All right, we do the kid dog. Alright, we do keep our items. We do keep our items. He's talking funny. But, um. Wait, wait for me. I'm coming in the garage right now. He's talking funny, but that's what I told him. Get on that video game and get to talking and. And just practicing talking because he's just going. I said, son, well, you really gotta try to talk regular. So, the fact that he's on there is actually a good thing today. Even though it's Tuesday, they didn't have class. They didn't have school on Monday and Tuesday because you know I do not allow any video games or YouTube during the week when it's a school week because it's like school is your job Monday through Friday, boo. But actually, him being on there is actually a good thing. So I'm letting him do that. Good morning, y'all. So I know I'm looking like yesterday. I'm literally I just took my son to school, but about to get in the shower. But they ordered me a new wig stand <laughs> and a new wig head. <laughs> and this is supposed to be Christmas, so I had to wait for him to go to work so I could actually open it. And I literally could not wait. Like, I know he didn't want me to open it till Christmas, but bro, like this. <laughs> This is going up to the same, baby. Oh, I'm just right here. Like, yeah. Yes, this seems so much more sturdier than this one over here. He bought me that one uh, maybe a couple of years ago, I believe. And I just need a new one. I already feel this is like so much more sturdy because that one over there that candace head i have literally like dyed so much hair on it to the point where that wig head is just kind of like done so i wanted me a clean wig head for videos and like when i'm not dying and plucking and stuff like that on so this is her she is really sturdy i love that for me 
I love that for me. And the wicked also came with something else. I wonder what else is in here. Oh, it came with a uh, attachment to where I could put the wig head like on something, but I'm not even gonna open this because I don't even wanna lose the parts, but it came with that. And I think it came with some T-pins, which is perfect because I don't know where my other ones are. And some needles. Needles and T-pins, beesh. Needed these. Needed those, and the TPS can just go right into her. But yeah, I'm supposed to be going to go get stretched, but right now I just do not feel that well. I don't know if the food I ate last night or whatever, but just not feeling so well. So I may end up canceling. Should I? It's literally only 30 minutes, but, but right now I'm about to try to get myself together or whatever and see what I can get done today. I need to really put this week together. So, I don't know. Let's see how that feels. Good morning, good folk. So, your girl is here. Don't look at my background. I am in the process of getting rid of some stuff. But I just got the shower and stuff. And I was actually putting on um, my headband wig or whatever. Because I'm going to work today. And um, I had to come on here and tell y'all. This wig grip. Y'all know I always use my wig grips, right? But I always use like a stocking cap and like my brown one. So, I was purging my hair closet the other day when I was looking for some hair and I came across this. I think I threw the packaging away, but my best friend actually bought it for me um, out of Ben Tom. If you don't have a Ben Tom near you, it's kind of like a place where um, people return Amazon packages and stuff like that. So, uh, she had gave it to me. <clears throat> In my little Christmas gift basket or whatever. And I had honestly just completely forgot about it until I was cleaning out the closet. And I seen I was like, we had grit with a cap. And I almost threw it away because I was like, oh, I ain't used it in all this time. Christmas is literally <laughs> around the corner. And I'm like, just need to get rid of some stuff, stop hoarding stuff. And I was like, I'm going to keep it. Bro, I put this thing on. This thing is bomb. It's because the cap is actually attached to the wig grip so and then it has this adjustable piece here and you can tighten it as tight as you want to but this thing ain't going nowhere like i absolutely love this so i went on to amazon um i went on to amazon to see if i could find a, another one and of course i put it in my cart but they are um 24 $24 i believe 24 25 dollars but I'm telling y'all, if y'all need a wig grip and a cap together, I'm about to go in there and order me another one. But this time I'm going to order it in brown because I feel like these caps, like, like they're not going nowhere. You can easily um, wash them and keep it moving. So it's not like something that you have to keep rebuying all the time, which is great, but I'm just so impressed at how well they work. Like, you know me, I usually wear a headband on top of this headband wig, but baby, she ain't going nowhere. I don't know if you can tell how hard I was pulling my head. I was getting a headache. How hard I was pulling my head, but literally it's not going anywhere. Even when I would have the other one on, my, and I feel like I kind of tied it too tight. Usually, I wear a headband on top of the headband wig just to make sure it's secure because I always felt like it just wasn't secure enough. But I don't even have to do that no more. I could literally wear this. And no, it's not going nowhere. Like, I can comb it, brush it, whatever. But that's a life sin. <laughs> 
That's a blessing. That's a blessing from Jesus. But I had to tell y'all about it because this is so dope. I probably never go back. I mean, not never, but I probably will never buy another just plain wig grip again because these things will last you like until they start like ripping apart which i don't know i've only been wearing it um a couple of days or whatever i had it on day before yesterday yesterday i didn't go anywhere i don't even know if i picked up the camera y'all yesterday honestly i mean i was uh filming and dying hair and revamping old wigs and stuff so that'll be a separate video but one of jay shirts which i know i'm gonna go into the barber shop and he'll be like it's my shirt and i'm gonna be like Oh my God. <laughs> by this point like how does he not know that I'm going to wear his stuff like how do you not know that you know I need to retint my eyebrows but that's not gonna happen today either and I do have a client today at 6 but, um, other than that, it's going to be a chill day. And yesterday, last night, y'all, mm, y'all, I made some turkey necks last night. I made turkey necks, collard greens, candied yams, and we ate the turkey necks just like over white rice. And it was so good. I've cooked turkey necks a thousand times before, but for some reason, these came out so good. I think because... This time, after the turkey necks are done boiling, I could put a little bit of flour and water to kind of like thicken it up, kind of make it like a little bit of a um, gravy and then pour them on top of the turkey necks. And the seasoning was just like, they were, they were seasoned so well. I hope I can remember. I should like go in there right now what the seasoning was on it, but... Um, Anybody got time for that? Bay loved them. Carter loved the sweet potatoes. He ate a little bit of rice. He's still having problems eating a little bit because of his retractor that's in his mouth. So I will see y'all whenever I'll get to the beauty supply store. But I had to come on here and show y'all that wig grip. Don't say I ain't never told you nothing. Period. It's almost two now. I'm happy because they finally got me the Wi-Fi password. Like, what the fuck was I supposed to do here? Sit and look. Like, whatever. I've been sitting here jotting down some notes and stuff um, about starting, you know, getting stuff done, business things that I'm trying to do, and getting my ducks in a row, seeing what I need to do, how much are fees, like, speaking to people, emailing people. So I did that. Bay just brought me some hot dogs up here. There's a great little hot dog spot across the street and it was like really yummy. So I had hot dogs for uh, lunch and now I'm about to leave here in about 10 minutes and go get Carter because um, yeah, I gotta pick him up from school so yeah i'm happy now so <laughs> don't worry about it okay <laughs> good morning peeps so today is friday october 15th Ooh, ooh! biden just paid us didn't he i don't uh <laughs> it's the 15th of the month but um good morning Good morning. I am at the beauty supply store. I've been up early because uh, I had some hair to do. Anyhow, like I said, I've been up early this morning. Um, getting things done. I had a client. I have one more at um, one more client at twelve o'clock. Booth rent is due today. Um, I don't know what I'm about to sit here and do. I'm so happy the Wi-Fi is out. Oh. So happy the Wi-Fi is working. 
or that I have the passcode or whatever, but um, yeah. So it's Friday, I don't have anything planned today besides working here at the store. Like I said, I have one more person at 12. Um, then that's about it, honestly. Um, and then I'll probably stay here to about six or till whenever Bay gets off. I'm leaving whenever Bay gets off. <laughs> that's what time I'm off today. So by the time he leaves, I'll leave here. Ooh. I think I want to buy me one of these tone rings, but I can't figure out how to get into here. But I need one. I'm going to put mine back in. My toes have been pierced since I was like 18, maybe 17. No, 18, 19. 18, 19 ish. Ish. I am hot. We have to figure out this air condition, bro. I think I'm supposed to. I feel like I'm supposed to turn that one up there on. I'm like extremely hot right now. Uh, damn it. They don't work. Flew into my mouth, country ass. <laughs> Y'all ever see that? But for real, something just flew at my damn mouth. So uh, yesterday while I was here, I was actually let me make sure she cashed out me for my money. Period. Like run me my money. So I don't know if I have plans. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Hell, I don't know. I wouldn't even mind not having plans. It's fine, but I do something about my original nails. But anyway, I'm gonna sit here and work, get some work done, try to get a little editing done by 11. I'm gonna go over and pluck her hair. I probably should like do that now. Let me go over there. I'm gonna pluck her hair real quick, but I'm gonna do that and yeah, it's Friday. Yes, welcome to the weekend, baby. <laughs> oh, I'm the Grinch. Oh, <laughs> what's up, guys? So today is Saturday. As you see, we're in Walmart, back in the Walmart, in the Christmas section. Wait, guys, look. That was unexpected. <laughs> Oh, I actually just came back to get a few more stockings. Carter needed headphones. I found some stuff that was like a dollar, so mm -hmm. I'll try it on. I'll try to make it look cute, but okay, we're not doing anything. We're just looking around in the Christmas section. See what Christmas stuff is here. Come on, Cardi. Gift boxes, three ninety eight. I feel like all this stuff I'm gonna need. And I feel like it's fine. First of all, come back into his house. Oh god. That's what I need. What are all these? A giant gift bag. That's kind of cute. I want a Christmas tree I know. I'm gonna get this for him because I'm gonna get him a new bike for Christmas. Hopefully, he won't even notice. That's what that is. What you doing, Cardi? You doing what? He must really like that thing. No, he won't let me. Come on. Okay, see up, see up. He must just don't want to be in there. I really like these signs. I wish I had a house, or when I get my house, I will be using signs like this. Ain't that cute? Mm-hmm. I think they're cute. Hello, you guys. Oh, 
I actually need it. I need this. How much is this? Ooh, 40 bucks. Oh, this is so pretty and thick. I need garland like this to do my wreath. Maybe we need to go in the fabric section. Maybe we do need to go in the fabric section. Look, there's another Grinch. Oh. <laughs> Go back in. I would love to send out Christmas cards. Maybe we take Christmas pictures this year and send them out to everybody. Oh, I want these. Like, am I really gonna send out Christmas cards? Am I really? Huh? Why you doing that? No, keep going. We're not quitters. <laughs> I got that totally wasn't scared. You totally was well, scared. Like, oh, I love those, but I probably found some of those at Dollar Tree. This is what I'm talking about. 99 cent. You feel me? Or 98 cent. I can get these and plant some. I need something to go with my flower pots. So, that actually be cute. All right, so I made it back home. Bae's here to go watch the game with his cousin him. But I want to show y'all what I got from Walmart. Look, I've already taken my bra off. But um, first thing I got was these jogger pants. Turn that TV off, boy. Look what you me what to do. That's how we take care of our most valuable asset. Our people. Okay, you know, like it's me, you wrong. The house smells like fall, don't it? Cranberries. No. Give me kids. Smell like you farted. Go get them. I need those. Oh my god. So at Walmart, I got these joggers. These are no boundaries, but they're slim fit. Uh, these are in the men's medium, but these were so cute. I've already tried them on. They fit so well. Thank you, babe. For me. But I thought these were like super, super cute. And you can kind of like dress them up or dress them down. So, I thought those were cute. I also bought this uh, nightgown set. Only because it's starting to get a little bit chilly outside. But it's just like basic. But it was like on clearance. If you don't hush and get out my <laughs> But it was on clearance for like $10. So it's just kind of like a loungewear um, type thing. It was originally like 17 bucks, but I got it for 10. And I could just wear this just around the house. Nice, comfy. The fact that I don't have a job anymore means that, you know, when a job gets here, I mean, I, I will still be working. But... <laughs> Uh, doing hair and stuff, but just lounging around the house. I just thought this was like really really cute. So I'm actually really excited to um, To try or to wear that and Next thing I got were some dollar items This was off the dollar rack. These are in a medium, but they're like for a dollar. <laughs> I don't know if I could fit into them Honestly, but if I can't, I give them to my little cousin or something. They're literally like a dollar. Or this could be like a gift or something. I don't know. They were a dollar. I just bought them. Uh, the next thing I bought for a dollar was actually this tank top, which I thought was really cute. Um, this is from what collection? This is No Boundaries. It was originally, what, $5.98. So not super expensive, but I thought this was kind of cute for a moment. Um, I don't know exactly. I probably wouldn't wear this this year, but I don't know. I thought that was cute too. I bought some ornament hooks because I'm so excited. Like y'all know, I'm so ready for Christmas that it's like not even a joke. And I also got some impressed press on nails. I just got them in black since we're going to the pumpkin thing tomorrow. I figured pla black would match kind of Halloween-ish. Maybe if I decide to put them on. And the last, or next to the last thing I bought was also a bra. I just bought this out of Walmart. Just because my other ones lately, I just feel like have not been given what they were supposed to have gave. Like, they're like, bras are starting to become like very uncomfortable. So I'm in the search right now to find um, 
more bras that are just like comfy because the first thing I did when I came in this house was take that bra off because it feels like it's like digging in my skin or it's not in the right spot or something so I think I need to go and be remeasured and all that like I'm too grown to not know what bra size but I swear my bra size flush fluctuates with my weight which is very normal but right now I just feel like it's it's just something else the one I had on was a triple D and I don't feel like I'm that anymore you know so last thing that I got that I'm excited about which baby was shaking his head as soon as I came in the door but ornaments for the tree so I bought all of these for like uh $17 I went ahead and bought them now because by the time Christmas time gets here, you won't be able to find ornaments like that. So that's why I've been kind of doing Christmas shopping early because I never really had the chance to just have fun and just go in the section early and actually find stuff. I always waited to the last minute because I've always been so busy working and everything else. I still didn't feel like doing that, but I bought these and this is kind of in the mint green color. So it's going to kind of be mint green and gold. And if y'all remember the last vlog, I bought... Um, the initials for everybody to go on the tree and they were white with black writing so i think they go great and those were only like a dollar with the little names on them but i thought these were just really cute so that's gonna be our color this year is mint green and so now that i know what color now i need to go to dollar tree and actually find some um flowers and everything to go into the tree now that i know the color because i was so confused as the color but where are you in there breaking? So anyway, so yeah, that was the last thing I got. So overall, um, and I bought Carter some um, some sweats. Uh, I bought him like three pair of like just jogger pants and two of the uh, hoodies that went with it or sweatshirts that went with it just to kind of get him started because he doesn't have any like joggers or stuff to wear to school and I think he's kind of out of the blue jean phase. He don't like wearing blue jeans to school. So anytime I see joggers, I bought each one of those for like $5.96 a piece. So since they had his size, it looked like they had just put them out. So that was great. That I was actually able to buy him some. Because last year when I tried to do that, they were all gone. I couldn't find nothing in his size. So we went ahead and bought a few of those. So yeah, that's all I got from Walmart. I love you. I love you. How long are you going to be home, baby? Till tomorrow. No, the fuck you not? I'm probably gone till November. You gonna die now? You gonna die now? Huh? Huh? Take huh? your ass. <laughs> I was strangling you, boy. See you tomorrow, man. You better bring your ass back. Mm -hmm. I love you. I love you. Be careful. I'm going to go party hard. You know what I'm saying? He about to go with his cousin and go drink and watch the game. Well, I'll sit here by myself. Locked up. All right, love you. Love you. I'm not kidding. Baby, take this trash out. Take This is the last bit of trash. I already taken out all those other Amazon boxes. Be careful, don't. Hmm. Love you. Love you. All right, so yeah, I think this is going to be it. I'm still trying to decide if I'm going to add the pumpkin festival. It depends on how much footage I got um, or how much footage I get tomorrow since we're going to the pumpkin festival. That's it. Today, I have literally just cleaned my entire house, washed linens, um, washed the bed sheets, all that kind of stuff. So I'm about to go put my bed back together. And then I'm going to sit around and enjoy a Corona because my house is completely spotless. Everything in this house is clean, which makes me feel so amazing. So that's all I did this Saturday. <sighs> yeah. And Carter had broke his... The only reason we went to Walmart because Carter broke his um, headphones for his game in there. And he about flipped out and I was like, it's okay, you can buy another one. So he spent his money buying one because he dropped it. It was his fault or whatever. So yeah, the only reason we was in Walmart and I should not know I was gonna pick up more stuff that I don't even know where I'm gonna put this stuff at, like where, where? But yeah, so 
depending on how the pumpkin festival goes tomorrow in Atlanta or what we end up doing tomorrow, how much footage I get. I may include this in this week. I may include in this week's vlog and just started out, you know, and ended out on a Sunday. Or I may end up taking that footage and putting it on next week's vlog. Um, I'm honestly not sure, but just in case, just in case, you know, I mean, I've been trying to do my intros, my outros. I have not did any thumbnails. I'm still gotta start remembering to do that. But just in case, this is it. I want to tell y'all bye deuces like go ahead and end this vlog here because yeah i don't want to leave this vlog without no ending and you know what y'all the real ones y'all my peeps for life uh, make sure you comment like and subscribe and if you've been watching and you're not subscribed and baby what do you baby why what do i need to do what do i need to do to get you su to subscribe hmm? but um Anyway, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Let me know what you think about this week's vlog. And I will see y'all in the next one. Mm.